cellobios cellobios again it is a disaccharide since it is a disaccharide it is made up of two monosaccharide that is a pair of beta d glucose that is two beta d glucose monosaccharides they are linked together through beta 1 4 glycosidic linkage in order to form this cellobios actually the cell cellobios is a part of a complex polysaccharide cellulose how means the cellulose is degraded by the hydrolytic enzyme cellulase cellulase enzyme okay cellulase enzyme degrades cellulose into short chains of glucose units that is known as cellobios okay the cellobios further degraded or further attacked by this hydrolytic enzymes to produce monomeric glucose units okay now i will show you how to draw the structure of cellobios in a very simple way start first of all draw the outline of two pyranose ring okay outline of two pyranose ring one pyranose ring structure is for one beta d glucose and the second one is for the other beta d glucose okay next let's fill the bonds okay just give the numbers 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 will come here okay then we can draw the bonds okay 1 2 3 4 Five and six will come here. Okay. Similarly, we can fill it here also. One, two, three, four, five and six will come here. Okay. Since it is a beta d glucose, since it is a beta d glucose, in beta glucose unit, we know that the OH group will present in the bond. in the top okay oh will be present in the top if oh is in the top hydrogen will come in the bottom okay this is uh, the difference major difference between beta d glucose and alpha d glucose in case of alpha d glucose oh will come in the bottom in case of beta d glucose oh will comes in the top okay remaining we can fill easily h oh oh h h oh c h 2 oh at h here also the same h oh oh h h oh c h 2 oh h okay the beta 1 4 glycosidic bond is formed between the first carbon atom of 1 beta d glucose with the fourth carbon atom of the second beta d glucose okay for the formation of bond this hydrogen atom react with this hydroxyl group and releases a molecule of water that when one molecule of water is released here only one oxygen atom is remaining okay here only one oxygen atom is remaining let us draw this oxygen atom in the center and just connect this this linkage is known as beta 1 beta 1 Four, okay, beta one four glycosidic linkage. 